Welcome back to Good Day Sacramento. What an honor to be in the presence of muralist Robert Bowman, who, as you can see, guys, is creating a mural on a garage. How cool is this? This piece is titled Goliath, and it went from canvas and now on to a garage at a residential building. And what, what I can say about this is this really speaks to the artistry in Sacramento and really what the city has become. We're going to interrupt Robert from his duties for the morning. Robert, good morning. Good morning. This is really cool. Welcome back to Sacramento. You live in San Francisco, now right? I do, yes. Yeah, so, so tell me, let's step over here so we could get a nice clean shot. But Robert, tell me just about this piece and the idea behind murals on garages. Um, funny story, this used to be um, the toy room gallery. Oh. So um, at the time, there wasn't really a lot of uh, outlets for this kind of art in Sacramento. And my friend John, who used to, used to run this gallery here, uh, gave a lot of people a voice and a place to show. Yeah. So uh, he had like said just a random post on social media last week, and I was like, "I'll paint your garage door for you." And he was like, "Seriously?" I was like, "Yeah, I'm coming to town, and that sounds fun. That'd be great." And that's it. That's it. Just like that. Just like hey, I'll paint your garage. No big deal. So again, it's titled Goliath, but I want to show that because Robert, it started with that canvas piece. Did you, you painted that, correct? Yes. So, so why did you choose that to then transition onto a garage? I just thought it'd be a perfect fit for the space. Yeah, and how long did it take? How long has this taken you to so create? Far, probably, um, we started yesterday morning around 10-ish. So from then, you know, wrapped up around 5 last night and came back around 8 this morning. Wow. So, you know, about so, 10 hours or so. That's so far. it. That's it. Now, I want to come a little bit closer because obviously a, a garage, I don't know if it's necessarily a canvas most people would consider when it comes to painting. Um, so is it all spray paint? Is it all paint it's a paint? What do you do? of um, brush paint, acrylic brush paint, and spray paint. Okay, awesome. Yeah. This is so cool. Now, mur putting murals on garages, is this like your new medium? This is something that you enjoy this to do? This is my first garage door. I've painted other murals. Like, I grew up doing murals, um, you know, graffiti and stuff like that, transitioned into fine art, like that canvas over there. Yeah. And um, I think the merger of the two is, would be, it's a great thing. Yeah. And I, yeah, yeah. yeah. Street so, art has taken off and it's, you know, it's, 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 it's back. This is really cool. Again, yeah. bringing some color to the city. Okay, I'll let you get back to that, uh, of course. So as he's painting that, I want to bring in the art lady, certainly no stranger to the show. Good morning to you. Good morning. So, so I want to talk about just in general art, artistry across Sacramento. We're seeing so much of it. Obviously, we know wide open walls, but my goodness, we're seeing not just murals on buildings and businesses, but now we're seeing it on residential garages. You know, 20 years ago, when he put the first mural on his garage, the city sent him a letter and tell, told him he had to paint over it because it was blight. So it's really nice that in 20 years, the Sacramento art community has really grown. And mainly the Sacramento people that live in Sacramento have really come to embrace public art and they kind of expect it as part of their environment now. This is so great. We also, we got a chance to meet Robert through you. So thank you so much for introducing us uh, to Robert. We do have to wrap it up, but if people want to learn more about just art in Sacramento, how can they do that? Um, you can go to the artladysacramento.com. Um, you can also look, Robert Bowen has a beautiful website if you're interested in his work. And the original piece over there will be on display at the Archival Gallery in East Sacramento. Very cool. We'll make sure to link all that information to our website, gooddaysacramento.com. But I don't know about you guys, but if I had a garage, I would certainly do something really cool on it. I do not. But one day I will. <laughs> that is so cool. Though. That is neat. Wow. Thanks, Ash. That's a good story, too, about it the 20-year difference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good stuff.